Okay, so now since we have set up our database, uh, let's go back to the case study and see what are the next steps in there. So here we are in our case study. So we have installed these applications using the start now it's free button and we also uh, you know chose the words edu dash in the name of the database because uh, we are learning and Odoo offers a free 24 month subscription to the students and teachers who are teaching or learning Odoo. So so we have installed these applications uh, the minimum four applications required for the first case and our next step is to configure our company in the database. So let's go to our database and I'll go to settings and now we can go to manage companies or update info. So in the companies section you can see uh, there are you know there is only one company uh, set up in our database. I'll open it and uh, let's rename the company to for example private limited abbreviate this you know it will take less space for the address I will put the address country Pakistan tax ID so let's go with one two three four five six seven dash eight company ID for example I want to go with UIN one two three four five and phone number email address let's copy this and this so let's add plus nine two before this and here as well and let's change the logo and I'll go to so you know I made this logo from uh, uh, from the scale up uh, you know uh, to cover page put it in the Canva and made this logo uh, and the website okay so for example let's put this as a website for now or oh, we, we can also you know go with this same this one let's go with this okay I think everything is set up let's just change the color to purple and everything as a setup we do not want to set branches right now you can see uh, here uh, all of the actions have been logged here so we'll click save and no I don't want to this is a chrome's message we don't want this and you see here we have uh, you know uh, updated logs uh, that the name email has been changed from none to this phone number has been changed from none to this and text ID has been changed this on today's date uh, your previous transactions were on the date of uh, 15th December so Odo also keeps you know all of the logs and what's uh, what else I can tell you okay so you know I'm taking a screenshot here and just so you know that this functionality is also available in Odoo so I'll go here back uh, to the database I'll create a log and I'll paste the screenshot we have just taken I just uh, you know uh, took the screenshot it is automatically copied to the clipboard and I now with the control V I've just pasted it and here it is in the logs I log it and you can see the image is here as well so you can also send messages uh, to the uh, you know to the followers of this uh, this transaction this is a non-financial transaction and you can create logs which will not be sending any emails or messages uh, to the persons but just you know uh, taking a log here and uh, in the in the chatter box okay so let's go back and uh, so now we have uh, you know set the company uh, our company uh, in our case is in setup in Pakistan